Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial from masterandroid.net and master android app in this tutorial i will show you how to make a progress bar and uh, declare it initiate it and make uh, use of uh, a progress bar and also we will make a small app that we can use the progress bar in a good example so let's start First of all, we will draw a drag and drop the progress bar of uh, of our app. Let's make its constraints and designing and the 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 height or the width make it as a constraint match constraint or zero dp. So now our uh, progress bar is named progress bar two. And let's go to main activity and start declaring it. Now, to pre to make progress bar, we should type progress progress bar. This is progress bar. You know, this is a package of uh, the uh, the progress bar. So we need to import this package or this uh, implementation and the class so progress bar progress bar let's go down to our own create active uh, method and let's see set the progress bar and find find oops find the view by id r dot id dot progress bar two so now we are uh, going good in progress bar now let's uh, make and see how to uh, customize the progress bar so i will increase the size now customizing the progress bar would be uh, done um, with certain methods so progress bar dot we can set the progress set maximum set the drawable set the uh, uh, drawable uh, hotspot changed get uh, max and many methods get progress and you'll see these methods how to use them later on in this video so let's see i will make uh, i will use set max set max method i will put it to 100 so 100 means 100 means that the progress bar is fully fully loaded 100 means that the progress bar is fully complete okay so now let's go to uh, see the another method that we can use in progress bar so progress bar dot set progress to 40 oops 40 okay so this method will 40 40 means that you are going uh, to see 40 over 100 as a progress bar display so you will this get 40 over 100 on this displayed 
on progress bar okay let's see what this means so okay let's uh, run our app okay i will choose i will choose some uh, emulators or my real phone okay 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 guys so uh let's see uh this is uh, our app uh the progress bar is 100 and the displayed uh progress is 40. it's 40 over 100 so our app is working very good so let's make a challenge or uh, some uh, and let's play with codes so the challenge would be a cha would be a very good to practice very good example to uh, to uh, to practice well okay so we need to make an app that when the user click a an a button it will increase the progress bar by 10% so if we have a progress bar maximum 100 and we need the, the a user to click the button to uh, to have 10% increment in this progress bar so i will uh, write the challenge down So when the user will click the button, it will uh, display 10% increment. Okay, so think about it. Think about, think about this progress or this challenge. Okay, let's solve it so the solution would be first we will make we will make first step we will make the button okay let's go to main activity xml uh, I, I would make uh, some uh, 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 design for this app so I go and download this image so in order to use it in the background I click here on XML and use the background and Wally I named it Wally I may I will make the the text look white to uh, be readable Oops. okay so the progress bar is here so I will need a button button here here the button I will name it is as click me Okay, it's named, it's ID is button. I will go to, to back to main activity. I will make it as button, button. And I uh, import it by alt and enter. 
and the package and the class will be imported so button let's make it let's initialize it r dot id dot but okay so the next step would be adding a click listener on it new view on click listener and we will see so when the user will click this button we will make the progress increase by 10 percent so remember the the progress is a float so the progress is float remember progress is a float so in order in order to increase the uh, progress by 10% we need to make a float variables so the float variables would be here so we will uh, make a float number float number set my progress I will name it, it as progress and initialize it by 0, 0.0 f which is the correct way to initialize the float number and I will delete this progress okay why because we are making the progress as a variable so here here we will make the progress uh, set the progress as a float number progress bar dot set progress to my progress into progress so here we need to we can make at a float by adding like this customize it as a float or by making it as as an int so we can make it as int uh, or as a float so for beginners we can make it as as a float uh, as an int so as an int we can make it for the progress here it since we initialized it by zero it will display the progress as zero now when the user when the user click the button we need to increase the uh, uh, variable by 10% so my progress here increase the value by 10% okay L let's back to my progress equal my progress plus 10 percent plus 10 this 10 means 10 percent so every time the user will click the 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 button the value will be increased by 10 every time the user increase the value by 10% my progress set the, and set okay let's let's see let's see and uh, run and see the error if there is an error uh, error or uh, or mishap or anything okay waiting the error studio to run it by the way I'm using uh, sync side uh, which is a very good app um, installed on uh, PC and uh, note 8 uh, uh, also if you want uh, the link uh, would be available in the description 
for full source code and uh, don't miss to subscribe for our uh, channel and get the latest tutorials uh, from our website masterandroid.net and let's see if there is an error I would uh, click this the if you see the progress increased by 10% then another click would increase it by 20% so 30 40 and 50 so we are making good use of progress bar so one uh, another example I would uh, uh, illustrate in this video in how to get the progress from progress bar so number two how to get how to get progress from progress bar I would use a toast to display the message so toast is toast is toast would inc would display the progress of my progress bar so I will make I would get here the message progress and don't miss when using when you need to make use of a toast and the variable you should use the plus sign so the plus sign here and the variable is my progress so the my progress would be here and also if you want to make a static static message you, you we use the quotations and when you use variables we use the plus sign don't miss to add a plus sign between the static variables and the variables okay let's start let's run it and show whether our app is working good okay here you see the progress is 10% I click the progress is 20 I click progress is 30 so don't miss to subscribe and uh, get the latest tutorials from our website and uh, our channel and don't miss to download our app and get many 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 tutorials that help millions of people learn Android. Thank you for watching. This is Abbas Masri from masterandroid.net.